Welcome back, everybody. Welcome if you are new. Today, we're in the big blocks here at Lincoln. It's very foggy track as well. We had a pretty good time. I know I could run like a tenth faster than that. I did in my last practice, at least. It was like just about a tenth faster than that. I think it was like a 682. But I'll be happy if we can get into like the mid to low sevens as well. Track's getting pretty worn in, which is good. It's really fast right now. So I imagine a bunch of people's times from practice are going to pick up most likely that didn't go back out and like run again. But the line's really weird here, it seems to me. Like, I kind of send it in the middle. Try to get it pointed straight for the exit. It's very bumpy on this back stretch right there. Send it in the middle here and try to get it pointed just straight down for the bottom. That's been, like, the fastest for me. That was only an 8, so we can definitely pick up some time. I think I lost it probably off the 2 there. The first lap. Might have gotten two sideways in three and four and two on that first lap. So what was that second one? 866. Not great, honestly. What are we right now? Eighth. So we're going to have some work to do in the heat race and everything. So, yeah, we definitely lost some time, unfortunately. I, I figured other people would probably pick up and uh, that didn't go back out. That probably ran these in the beginning and then ran now and qualifying tracks totally different because it was a pretty clean track to start with. And uh, got pretty fast now. I think I just missed the line a little bit too much there in qualifying. It is what it is. We'll hopefully be able to move our way up. There are 20 cars here. It's a pretty full field. I think it could hold 22. But we're definitely going to have a consig race. But uh, So 7 make it from each heat. So we just need to be top 7 to make sure we make it to the feature race. So I'll bring it back when we're getting ready to take the green and the heat races. All right, we are back in fifth for heat number one, so we qualified ninth. Not the best, so hopefully we can gain some spots here. At least we're starting on the bottom, and we'll be bottom yeah, for the feature race as well. I feel like the bottom's a little bit better the right. than the uh, middle or top. Just gets so like wide out there, and you just slide a whole lot. So I don't. I, it's just a weird track. I haven't ran it too much. I think I've ran it like once or twice. I know I ran in uh, one of Gavin's hosted in like a super here, and I think I did like one other hosted race here. I forgot what it was exactly. But haven't done a whole lot of uh, racing here in general so yet. So this is like my first luck, official race. First official race at this track. So hopefully it can go pretty well. Somebody DC'd out. That's unfortunate for them. Really was hoping we'd qualify better. But people's times are pretty tight. Because I was back in ninth with an 866. Paul has his, uh, 699, which is a solid lap. So we definitely dropped the ball there had like a much better time in practice obviously with like a tenth quicker i wonder where that would have put me honestly i don't know where it would have put me i would have been right around the uh number 17 second place car that 44 on the side of his car up there i would have been right around his time i think i was like a thousandth off of his time All of our supporters, everybody that's with us so probably today, would have been around like fourth ish which would have been pretty good that okay, would have been a much better uh start for us for this heat race pace truck goes off there on the back stretch so there's a long way till we go actually green here in three and four i'm pretty sure coming off four quickly the the it gets the green had a good start there got the fourth real quick hopefully we don't get ran over we're good hopefully we can get into the inside of the 44 nope i got too much on throttle i think Got to the inside of him there. I think we got tapped in the left rear is what that contact was. So I'm not trying to like throw a slide or anything up on him, but we're up to third. Solid. Solid heat race so far. Guy behind me is definitely throwing it in a lot deeper than I am. So that concerns me a little. But as you can see, that bottom really paid off for us to start the uh, heat race here. Which I'm really happy about. I'm hoping those two behind me will battle some so I can kind of get away from them. Because that guy behind me is just sending it in these corners and like slamming on the brakes, I think, to not hit me. But I'm catching the 77. That was a good three and four. I think I can roll this bottom. If I can stay inside of him, I'd get him in three and four. I think I can get him here in three and four, I hope. Nope, I got way too sideways. He had a good three and four there. Good good corner. 
Nope. Where did the guys go behind me? <laughs> Ain't nobody behind me no more. You can definitely make some passes though here, which is fun. I'm kind of shocked with the side-by-side -side racing. It's been pretty good so far. I thought it would be kind of worse. One lap to go. White flag this time. See if we can get him this lap. Had a good heat race though. I'm very happy with it. Leader up there is going by a lap car. He just had to check up so he didn't get wrecked or wreck him. Good race with Liam there. That was fun. We're car number two in this 20 car field. So hopefully we could finish pretty well. This will start us in fifth for the uh, feature that's pretty good we were starting ninth so that's a big improvement job, i'm very that. happy about that that was a that was a hell of a race good, good battle time. though liam that was a lot yeah, of fun girls with blue hopefully feathers. we can have as good of a feature race but we'll get on to heat number two here i want to actually see some of that battling because uh right off the bat really we were we had a good start the 98 did not have a very good start out there able to run this bottom and get to the inside there was a wreck back there get to the inside of him he held the outside for a corner we were almost getting hit by the uh, six a whole lot that was what mason i think yeah the one right behind me but we had a really good battle there with uh liam once i caught him slowly caught him because i was almost getting hit a couple times but you look at that exit right there i think this was turn three Turn three and four, able to get that cut down. Worked really well for us. Very, very happy with how that is. How that was working for us, at least. But solid, solid race. Able to run side by side pretty well. This fog is uh, interesting, though. But let's get on to heat number two here. See what's going to happen here. I don't even know who's in it. Who's on pole? Number three of Kevin. We'll see what happens here. Is there a better angle? Yeah, let's go with this angle. Like back in the stands or spotter area. Top seven make it. And the rest are going to have a consolation race. I'm happy we're going to make it no problem, which is nice. Had a really good run there. I am happy we're on the bottom for the feature, like I was saying also. Because if it goes as well as it did in the uh, heat race, we can gain a couple spots out of it. Which would be really nice. These two guys are about to hit back here, it looks like. The 11's like swerving back and forth a little bit. But they got one more time around till they take the green. I don't even know what number Kevin is. Is that the 110? I'm assuming. There's so many weird numbers in this one. The 110, the 33R, 88, 1, 11, 15, 20. I think somebody's missing. Oh yeah, there's a couple people missing way back there. Yeah, what the hell is going on back here? Like, this guy is so far back. The 404. I don't know why he's so far back, but he's trying to get a jump is what's happening, it looked like. And it did not pay off for him. So let's watch this battle up front. See if the guys on the outside can hold it. The 11 car almost ran over to the 33R. 88 making a move for the lead already. Able to hook that inside in turn one. Oh, 11's getting beat around. Going around. Saved it, though. Watch this battle for lead. The 88 got around him in three and four as I like clicked off of him. He had that bottom lane going into turn three, but the 110 got back to the inside here to three and four. You can get that outside the hook. Oh, big crash back here. Somebody's upside down. The 404, what happened there? He went flipping around. He got into the one car and then the 515 had nowhere to go. So big crash back there. Where are the front guys? Oh, the 88's getting passed by the 33R now. Tight racing. He's right on his bumper. The 110 got back out to the lead. 33R running the bottom there in three and four. The one car is starting to catch them both. So it's interesting to see the line develop at this track. It seems like that middle of one and two where that grip is is really, really fast for that front uh, car of the 110. The 88 trying to make that bottom work. It's so hard to run like off the turn four under somebody unless they go really wide. 
Because other than that, they can just pinch you off really easily. I feel like there's going to be some wrecks there coming off turn four. Somebody like trying to cut down a little bit and somebody gets under them going into the corner and they don't realize it. Definitely can be some wrecks there, I believe. Oh, 88 got into the 33. Do I have everything unmuted? Yeah, I do. So 88 just got into the uh, 33R. He's going to take second place there. What lap are they on? Seven? Slider behind 25 and the 15 they are battling They're all in right now. The 11 car is still in with his uh, wreck earlier Those, all, Everybody in front of him is in as well. This is the final lap final corner. Is anybody gonna send it? Nope Everybody stays pretty clean So all of them are gonna make it and the guys behind the 11 car are not gonna make it so good battle though The 88 made it real interesting, which I think was the 13 of fire swamp. That's such a funny name I saw that in the uh practice lobby i'm like there's no way this is that dude's name but apparently it is so that's uh, really interesting <laughs> where are they from i want to know new york <laughs> makes sense i guess but there's uh six people fighting for what like is the top two ma oh the top four is making it so there was seven wait there's 18 18 are going on to the feature race that's kind of crazy i thought it was gonna be 16 but Maybe there's 24 people that can end up in this uh, lobby. So four out of the six people are making it and two of them aren't here. So every, all four that are racing that are right there on the screen are the four that are making it. So I'm going to skip these uh, 10 laps of the constellation for you guys. And I will see you guys. We're getting ready to take the green in the feature. All right. Time for the feature race. We're starting in fifth. Had a really good heat race. Well, Hopefully we can keep that up. Inside. Starting on the inside here. There were some fast people in that second heat though. It's gonna be to our outside. So it should be interesting some real fast guys out there I'm hoping we could stay around this. That'd be nice to so try to gain some spots do the best we can really Hopefully we just don't end up in a wreck. That's my main thing. I don't want to end up turned or flipped over That'd be disappointing Every time I feel like every time I talk about something and I say I don't want this to happen It happens to me. It's like a freaking curse. I put on myself Cause I feel like when I do my World of Outlaws game, I say, all right, let's try to do well in this, or hopefully I don't hit these tires down here this race. And I do the op, I literally go straight into the tire or do an awful, have an awful race, something like that. It's inevitable. Or I say like, hopefully this is a clean race, it goes green to the end, it's nothing but cautions. <laughs> so maybe I should just stop like hoping on what a race is gonna be. Cause it never pans out for me, I feel like. But we have the bottom side here like we did in the uh, heat race. I'm hoping that goes well for us. It's not too slicked off through the middle. I think you can still get down to the very bottom and uh, get it to hook up. These cars are like so weird to drive at so slow speeds too. They really pull to the left hard. And I hate it. And then as soon as you hit the gas a little bit, they kind of straighten out. And then you're slowing down again and they jerk around. I'd much rather drive this thing at like half throttle or three quarter throttle, like going fast yeah, than under pacing. Under pacing sucks here in these cars. The late models are kind of the same way. They kind of suck under slow speeds too. But pace car is off. We're getting ready to take the green to start this race. And let's have a good race, everybody. Good luck to them out there. There's a lot of fast people. We had a really good battle up here. He went a little earlier than he did in the heat race, but that's fine. Slid up in one and two, but that's fine. I think there's a guy to my inside. Yeah, just a little bit. I was trying to get to the inside of the 88 here. Not able to make that happen. Definitely slid up a lot in one and two that first quarter, which I wasn't really trying to. That was a good one and two though. Compared to the lap before. Outside. Side by side. You're clear, clear. If I can get this bottom to work again, I should pull away a little bit. Solid. I'm getting that bottom to work in one and two. Oh, he had a good cross over there. You're clear. 16.0. He kind of slid up really hard though, so he did not have a very good exit. Okay, we just got doored. He was way, he was completely behind me and there's a huge wreck because of it. 
Like, he was straight behind me, did not have a run or anything. He did not have a run on me or anything, and I went low, and he sent it in low on me, and then got to the side of me and got sideways and caused that huge wreck. Like, I don't put that on me at all. Because I was completely clear of him and had the speed down the back stretch, so... I don't know how anyone could blame that on me, I think, but we'll go. Oh my goodness. Okay, he, he's on his side. That's unfortunate for the six car, but um, got a couple laps here under caution. That was a big ass wreck though. We're starting in fourth. I don't know if it's gonna be single file or double file. I forgot. I honestly forgot if uh, these big blocks are single or double file. If we're double file, we're gonna be on the outside, which is kind of unfortunate, but we can make the outside work a little. I think you can make either lane work right now, honestly. But we'll see. Is it single or double file restarts? I always forget. Hit the one to go. Okay, one we're on the outside. Go. Okay. Because I know like some are single file, some are double file. I think the 360s the I did point were point single point file, I want to say. A, a like a week or two ago. Right where we had a good box. race at Eldora. I think we those were single file there. race. Or single file restarts. Trying to not run the back of this guy. He started speeding up a little earlier, so I kind of knew he was going, but I didn't start going quick enough. Okay, Why? everybody's getting rammed in turn one, and people are flipping. Why? What were Why people doing there? Oh my more. goodness. Like, people from the bottom oh, were pushing up the guy on the low side of me Three into me. Three wide on the start down the front stretch. <laughs> And then Close. just barrel roll into the corner. Like, what are you <laughs> they doing? literally barrel rolled into the corner. And there is one of the cars that barrel rolled. They're still on the roof. I've been getting drilled weird all day too, man. What is going on? So we're in third. <laughs> I'll take the 4X. We're in third though. That's freaking crazy. Like the guy on my low side got punted up into me. And then Lab like five, everyone went out to the wall. Breaks. Half the field's already taken out. <laughs> <laughs> For real. Hey, if you did your uh, tow in time, you might be able to get out here to be on the lead lap. Yeah. Closed. That first wreck, they might be on the lead lap still, honestly. But we're in third, somehow. I'll take it. I feel like, like, we've gotten 4X, like, from both incident, like, both wrecks so far, but... The first one, I definitely don't think was on me, and then that second one definitely was on somebody behind us, where they just sent everybody into that corner. I am kind of happy I'm on the high. I was on the high side for that wreck because I was able to go all the way out to the wall and just kind of ride it and um, missed it all for the most part. I know I got some damage, but don't know how much, honestly. It looks like I have some damage on like the front where I have send it and stuff. It looks like it's all scraped up and stuff or on the left side of my panel right here. Like, what is this race, though? I'm so confused. Okay, he's getting a little bit faster rolling speed here before he takes the green. Let's have a good run, please. I was way too sideways on that start. Because you can get this bottom rolling and it actually works quite well in one and two. I need to not just floor it off the corner, though. Three and four, you could floor it off a little bit more. One and two, not as much. Cause it's so bumpy and caution already. Jesus. All right, that happened somewhere in the back. It wasn't near us at least. What is this race? <laughs> I thought we were gonna have such a good uh, feature race with how the heat were going. The heat races were so clean for the most part. At least my heat was. The second heat, not as much, but our heat was pretty good. It was a pretty good race. But that's unfortunate. We just keep getting cautions now because I feel like I had a decent run going on for those that lap or two. <laughs> that was a quick two laps, but we're still in third. I'm happy being on the bottom. I do like the bottom to say. Because I feel like we are kind of fast down here off of two mainly three and four. I feel like that middle of the top can work pretty well, but I also feel like you can make the bottom work if you run it right. So I'm gonna try to stick to the bottom as much as I can because I haven't really practiced going to the outside much at all And I don't really want to try to lose a bunch of spots when it's not needed right now I'm just wondering how many people are a lap down or something Like how many people are a lap down only 17 places shockingly 
That is kind of shocking, to be honest. I thought more people would be a lap down, but we may not have had too many laps to be able to get somebody a lap down. Because <laughs> I thought there'd be some people. I know there's multiple people that got flipped and wrecked. But they might have gotten out in time for the um, green flag, I guess. And they just keep getting quick cautions to save them. All right, he's picking up his pace a little bit like he did the last time. Let's not stomp on it and get sideways. Try to gradually get on it. That was a freaking great start by me. Got up the second. Try not to slide up into that outside lane. And caution. And we're yep, in second here we now. Go. People being assholes again. <laughs> that was a hell of a start I had, though. Got up to second because of that. You're just driving like a total idiot. I want to get a good run though. We're having How am I? I we're having some racing wrong. up here. Fun. What are they talking about? Because people are mad at each other. Need to have a little more patience. <laughs> I want. I know he was in fourth. So me lifting and getting fun is my fault, and not having patience. Because <laughs> I know second place didn't have a great start, but now we're in second place, so I'm going to be in that position. Wide down the front stretch. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of wrecks to go back and see. I wish there'd be this many wrecks, or at least three wrecks in, a, in less than 10 laps, go single file. Just go single file restarts after that. Like, that's kind of, it's just going to keep causing wrecks. I know the last 10 laps are going to be single file, but if, if you get like three cautions in less than 10 laps, go just make it single file. I wish that was a thing that they could uh, implement. Because that would make things so much better. Because I feel like this is just going to be a wreck fest. And we may not even... It's a 36 minute timer. But we may be pushing it. <laughs> we honestly go. may be pushing that time limit. You're gonna be on the outside. Yeah, this outside restart is going to be interesting. I haven't done an outside restart yet. Right, well, man, I'm not looking forward to it. Well. But I kind yeah, of I'll have the timing of this guy down a little bit when I'm behind him. But being next to him is going to be completely different. Because I know he starts to go pretty quick through these corners. Yeah, that was a great start. I had this guy's timing pretty good. Oh, I'm two sideways. That's on me. And everybody's wrecking behind me anyway, so it didn't matter. Like, I think, was Fire Swamp the one behind me? I don't think so. Why can nobody, like, just not wreck, though? I got sideways at the very uh, top, like and there's multiple people that are just stopped right here. There's just been so many wrecks. Oh, it's saying uh, go around them. The they may be stuck a lot down potentially, or be or get black flagged. There might be there might be a bunch of people that DQ out of this race. <laughs> oh, what a mess of a race this is. Cause I don't know if I technically caused that one, even though I got a zero X out of it, because I know somebody bumped me. Because I got real sideways, but they were checking up for me. Oh, yeah, that guy is stopping up there now because uh, he got stuck a lot down now. That's unfortunate for him. But there's been, what, five cautions already in nine laps? <laughs> oh, look, the sun's coming out finally. The fog is still here, but the sun's coming out. That's beautiful. <laughs> I think it should stay dark because that this is this kind of race with how uh, bad it's been so far. With everybody wrecking. I think the only clean car is this first place yeah, my guy. bad, Austin. I was coming up the track and I got score early One to go. on that start. Everything shakes the way it is right oh, now. Oh, you're, you're all fine. On the outside. I don't I don't think anything was Just on got, him. I got, like, hella nervous because I didn't know what the car was doing there. <laughs> no, I don't, I don't think any of that was on him. I don't think anything was on him at all there. I think I got sideways getting too much on throttle because like, I was happy I was on his outside. All right, can I time his restart again? I timed it decent, not awful, but not as good as the last one. But yeah, definitely get sideways up top. Got to be more careful on throttle. Got a guy to my inside now, which I want to be down there. I ran too high there. Yeah, I don't know the brake, not brake, but like let off points to go into the corner very much. Oh, the 404 is up here. 
he was in the consolation race geez like he qualified really far back and was in the consig i really don't want to be out here especially for turn one i feel like turn one i can make that bottom work all right too hard into three and four there I just feel like there's room to make the exit of turn two work. If I'm not up slow one up top, that's gonna be a caution, yeah. Oh yeah, he's stuck right there. And he got out, okay. That was gonna be sketchy trying to get around him and stuff. We fell back to third, that's okay though. I, I like the bottom more. It was a better start by us, like on the outside, didn't get sideways through the first corner, so I was fine by that. I'm just confused how the 404 is up here. He's car number eight but he qualified slow was in the consolation race and now he's up here in fourth maybe because of wrecks i don't know i'm hoping we can just stay out of some wrecks with these restarts and just survive it at this point with how crazy they've been it seems we still only got a 4x that's fine i'm not worried about my safety my safety is completely fine i just want to gain some damn iterate and i've lost like 250 on the uh, dirt side or so maybe a little bit more honestly we gained a little bit back and got back straight to 4,000. I think like going into this race, I'm exactly 4,000. So I'm hoping we can gain some in this one, which would be interesting. You're gonna be coming around the gate. Everybody's already like double filed up. Well, not everybody, but a lot of us up here are already double filed up. I wish we were just, we were two to green and then one to green this time. That would've been nice, but oh well. But I have the timing of this leader down on these restarts. Like he does like the same thing every single time right now. Yes, sir. One to go. So when I was on his outside, it really was not that bad for me. And being behind him, I might be able to get back up in a second. And the uh, eight car is hitting the guy in second. He went a little bit later that time. I was like all over his bumper, but he went a little bit later. And the 404 is spinning out. That's causing a huge wreck. Jesus, what is wrong with people? <laughs> Why can't ever anybody just keep it going? I saw that immediately. Like the 404 was just spinning out in the middle of one and two, and I'm like, that that's just gonna cause everything because he was going back down the track too. Oh my goodness, how many people are gonna DNF out of this race? Is what I want to know. Like too many incident points. Well, it's probably my last uh, <laughs> big block race of the night. <laughs> I figured like Lincoln is a new track. I heard that it's very really tough and might have a lot of cautions like this. So I wanted to do this race early in the week. Like I'm doing it on a Tuesday at 6 p.m. And what's the time limit left? We still have 30 minutes. We should make the tie, like the laps, I would think. If we can get any sort of green flag run. But um, I, I was thinking maybe later in the week, this uh, may not have as much participation. I really want to race it with it being Lincoln, being a new track. And uh, yeah, it's a wreck fest. It's not going well. Like, I feel like I have some speed, but it's just, we just can't get anything going right now. There's going to be a lot of incidents to go back and watch after this one, though. So there's going to be a lot to, to see. Watch the uh, incident thing just get bugged out immediately, and then we can't really watch the incidents. Honestly, it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. There's just a lot of wrecking. <laughs> oh... But I think uh, the thumbnail is probably going to be somebody flipping behind me while I'm up at the wall. That, that like, second restart or whatever. Or the first time I was in second on the outside. I don't know which restart it was. I think it was, like, the third or fourth. But I think that's probably going to be the thumbnail. Somebody flipping right behind me and everybody's crashing into that corner. Because I think there was only, like, me, the uh, car in front of me drew, and I think Fire Swamp made it out of that. And I don't know where Fire Swamp is now, but... Delayed green. Didn't even realize we we're on the delayed green, honestly. Like, I was ready to take the green and never realized that the uh, pace truck went Looking or stayed out. I have had a dirt race finish on time limit instead of the last, like, recently, too, which has been sad. But those races happen every now and then. Decent start. Got away from the guys behind us besides fourth place. I'm going to try to hook this bottom. Really let off and just get down here. Outside. And caution immediately. Oh, Jesus. Oh my God. 
Like the four of us up here were running tight. You guys can't even make it through a corner? No, no they can't. No they can't. This race is a mess. I don't know what's going on, but this is like the best session for pacing ever. <laughs> this We're probably gonna have the slowest race average of any race this week. <laughs> I just, I don't understand why you can't just take it easy for a lap, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, let it get spread there's out. 26 laps left. With 28 minutes left, which will come first. <laughs> oh, what a mess this race is. I say 28 minutes. <laughs> probably the good bet. Probably a good bet, honestly. That's kind of sad to say, but probably a good bet. I wish it had the deal like in real life where it goes single file if you don't get a lap in yeah i was thinking if they had like three cautions in 10 laps just put it single file somehow but I, I, if they could somehow put that in <laughs> that'd be great yeah, single file would be really helpful right now yeah we couldn't get to the last 10 laps fast enough <laughs> i don't even know if we can the get to the last 10 laps has that little mini antenna on it because literally we probably made a total to of right five green flag laps like after the initial yeah, green flag on, on a restart hey, we might have made five ready. total laps ready. after that right, dude, this whole race that thing out real well. which is really really sad nope. like congrats to the 10 car on having a zero x <laughs> we had a good jump on that one we beat the nine car to the line so we're in second right now. If a caution were to come out, which probably will. I'm waiting for it. <laughs> like, where is the caution? Because you can get some side-by-side -side racing here. I slid up too much. We got on the brakes a little bit too much there, but we stayed on the bottom really well. I'm right there on that wall though. Clear high, 16. I like one and two on the bottom. Three and four is a little bit better up top, it seems. Oh, I think he got the wall. Yeah, we're clearly in second now. Until a caution were to come out. 16.36. Yeah, I don't want to be right in the middle like that. But the top and three and four, I feel like, has speed. And bottom and one and two is what I like. Oh, freaking wall. I hope I didn't bend my right or front and left tire much. And caution. I got saved by that. We might have bent up our front and left tire, which is unfortunate. Hey, sorry, Liam, about that last quarter. Just got in a little hot. Didn't mean to push up. I tried going in low and just got a little too low there. I think I think my left my left uh, front looks bent in now. That's not great. It might be a little tight now. Like it might be a little too tight to uh, turn into the corner well. But at least we're on the outside, so I don't have to worry about pushing up on somebody in the first corner. That was probably the most laps we had green so far. Now we only have 25 minutes left with 20 laps <laughs> instead of 26 with 28. Oh my! What a race! How many people have gone through the pits to get damage fixed is my thing. Because you got no fast repair in these either. I think they're a B-class race, I want to say. At least. Something like that. Yeah, I think there went the 404. Kyle, I think he was the 8 car. That was the 404. I want to know how many people DNF'd out. Like, complete 12x. Got disqualified from the race. Honestly, what if we just like told everybody to line up single file? Would they do it? Like, would people actually like agree to run, like start single file? Probably would be for the better. But then there's gonna be somebody back there be wanting to try to get some spots and be side by side, so it probably won't work, honestly. But I think I bent up my left front, so it's not great. I need to be able to see this guy. Green flag, green flag. He started to go, I went, and then he like stopped. And then I let off to not go past him. And I was gonna run his ass over if I didn't check up. And we're three wide. We're all the way around. Inside, inside. 
Now five, we're back in the hornet's five, nest, which is not great because I don't like the outside. One and two is not zero, bad on the nine, outside, one, but zero. I just like the bottom more. Five, this track is bumpy as all hell. Zero. And if I could have just five, not gone low on that one corner and hit the uh, inside wall five, and then a caution three, came out right zero. after that, my car would be fine. To run the bottom uh, and caution uh, came out <laughs> immediately Man, at least we're getting three laps instead the of road, one that's close. nice <laughs> this race is a mess is didn't run they awful did open, there but didn't run very out. well that was a couple laps yeah at least we're getting like three at a time instead of one now <laughs> <laughs> picking up that average lap pace slowly climbing up there <laughs> We just need to get to the last 10 laps. We just need at least like seven, eight more laps to get to the last 10. <laughs> oh, what a mess this race is. Probably like the worst race I've been in in a long time. Besides like the, since the last one that got uh, timed out, which I think was a super late model race, I want to say. I don't remember which super late model race it was, but I could be wrong about the race as well. But I think it was a super late model race timed out. But now I'm not right with the 10 car. I'm not on his outside or right behind him anymore, so I can't do his uh, timing. I have his timing down. I have it down to a science perfectly. Uh, I didn't hear anything, but it appears to be one to go. Well, we're on, we're the, on the outside. The one car needs to get to the outside here. Come on, baby. It's all you now, man. Yep, now he realizes oh. nine car got to his inside. Ready. You gonna catch up to the leader there, bud? He's like so far off of him. There he goes. It's hard to drive these things slow, though. So I'm like not trying to run him over, but I'm trying not to get ran over at the same time. Green flag, green flag. Not having a great start the second in the outside. Yeah, he slides up hard in one and two up front. That's uh, that's what like kind of messed me up too. I didn't want to run him over, so I checked up. He's throwing a slider for the lead, and we were checking up there, and we got flipped. Please land on the wheels. Please land on the wheels. Fuck. That's how this race is gonna go, really. That's so annoying, man. Like we just check up a little bit to not run over the guy in front of us because everybody's accordion up, and we get ran over really quick that's how like all these wrecks have happened huh we got ran over by who by fire swamp nice because he literally you see him gas it there and we just get absolutely murdered and somehow don't flip thank over you. on our wheels thank you so that's super unfortunate hopefully we can get back that's out here quick clean slider just just what <laughs> he like stopped this sentence I think they're on two to green, back probably the whole coming, field up. coming around to they one to green. They couldn't handle it. Yeah, back to fourth handled it, and then after that, no. <laughs> yep. That's what happens. Are they going one to green now? I'm trying to it's see. It's weird, you let off the gas, you don't wreck. <laughs> so some from behind wrecks you. Yep, exactly. Are they double filing? I think they're doubling up. Damn it. I think I'm going to be able to get out of here, right. like, right after they go green. Something like that. Maybe not. I might be a lap down. That's going to suck. Let me out of here. Let me out of here. Yeah, they're going to be going around. I'm going to be a lap down now. That really sucks. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, go. Go, 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 go. Oh, don't speed. And everybody's coming out. I'm not going to cause a caution. I don't want to. Because this pit road is dangerous. Coming straight out on the track like that. So I'm pretty sure I'm a lap down now, which sucks. Maybe I won't be if a caution comes out right now, because I am on lap 26 when I was on 24. Don't know how that happened, but... I'm in last for the people running, which is 11th. But that's kind of sad when 11th is the last one running right now. 
But we're so far back. I'm just going to try to keep the car clean. Try not to hit this inside wall anymore. And just hope for... A Watch, there won't be any cautions the rest of this race because I got wrecked out. <laughs> That's what's going to happen. I don't think I'm going to lap down, honestly. Those guys are still white on my relative. So I don't think I'm going to lap down right now. So caution would be beneficial for me at the moment. But every time I need a caution is when one doesn't come out. And I'm not going to bring one out myself. I could have poked my nose out and brought out a caution out of pit road, but that's just... That's stupid. I'm never going to do that. I don't want to cause a caution, especially when there's been this many in the race already. Like, it's been a ridiculous one already. Even though the bottom where I'm running at is still super worn out, like, I like running it better. I can just pace my way through it and get on it when I need to. Trying to not spin my tires. I think I'm catching these guys anyways in front of me that are slow. They're run they've been running in the back the entire time, probably with some damage, but now there's 10 laps to go. Like I said, won't get a caution when I need it. That's what happens. See if we can get a top 10 out of this. Leader's starting to catch us, but I don't think he'll have time to catch me. Because I run decent enough laps. I don't think he's going to catch me a second a lap. He might catch me a tenth or two a lap, because I definitely have some damage. But this track's super, super bumpy. Like, on the back stretch. Coming off turn two, um, there's just a million bumps. So, watch out for that when you run this. Just be careful on throttle. Probably not prefer to be on it fully. Unless you run super low like that. If you're going up in the groove up top, it's super bumpy. Even on a fresh track, it's bumpy. But yeah, look, I've, I've kept pace with the leader. He's eight seconds behind pretty much on the straight. And that's what he was at when he started popping up like 8.1 he's only at 7.9 now like we have speed we just got screwed out of position oh there's a caution there's a caution i may get some i may get some spots out of it and overall <laughs> oh is that the lead? oh no 10 car uh second three cars in the lead that doesn't make any sense i think i think that's the guy that went into the uh pits like toad that just brought out the caution you can't catch you guys. <laughs> All right, I may be able to get some. Done. I may be able to get some spots out of this overall. We will see. I think we're top ten right now because we were eleventh, and then that caution happened, and we went back to twelfth for some reason. But that doesn't make any sense because he has like a three-minute lead over everybody. So I think that has to do with the. Uh, a now, at least. Yeah, that's true. I think it has to do with the uh, towing to the uh, pit lane. It's weird. But I should be able to get a couple spots out of this, I think, before the end. We're not going to hit the time limit. At least there's 15 minutes close. left. That's nice. But what a what a turn of events this race has came. We were running, like, top five the entire race until we got spun, which is just, hey, dude, just frustrating. You know, my car's drunk. Oh, you're all good. I'm just trying to run the bottom, so if, if you want to run high like you have been, I'll probably get around you. Oh uh, yeah, that sounds good. I, got the to run I think that's what I think he said all I can do is run the high side, maybe. Be smooth, just be smart. Just as long be as he focused. gets going when the green flag so drops and thing. I don't pass him before the start finish, I'll be happy. But I wanna try to get some spots out of this. So I think I can get a couple. I think I can get him and the eighteen. The eighteen's been pretty slow too. Ready? Oh no, you're so slow off the start. All right, we're good. Outside, door quarter clear. Outside, outside. I almost hit that wall. Clear, outside. Clear. Outside. Clear high, clear high. He's definitely not just loving me, letting me have it though. He's racing, which that's fine. Clear, clear. I figured he would. Seven, five, five. Cause I was gonna run this line anyways. We're outside. fine. He sent outside. it into turn three and had it stick down there, or up there, I mean. So what are we, 10th now? Yeah, we're 10th now. I think we can get up to 9th. Got two laps left, though, so maybe not. 
Maybe on the last lap, somebody will get dumped and we can get by them. Who actually had a good run there in three and four on the 18. Probably should have been full throttle down the front stretch. I think I was just drifting down the entire front stretch. Come on, 18, overdrive it. Nope, he ran good. All right, I'll take 10th, I guess, after we got flipped and sent to the pits. So, that's Great unfortunate. Finish, guys. Number one car ended up winning it. Good for him. Like, he ran pretty good. 10 car ran really well. He, he led just about every lap, but what a freaking dumpster fire of a race that was. How many X's do people have? Three people DNF'd out. The uh, 20, the 15, and the 6. And then the 18 had 10, the 13 had 10. If either, if I would have gotten into the 18 uh, hard enough, he would have uh, DNF'd out. We got a 6X, but oh my, let's try to see these incidents because there's, th this might be a minute. Get the, sit down, get your popcorn if you want. There's gonna be a lot of incidents though, but we had a good race going. We had a real good race going and this is, yeah. Okay, so he wrecked us later in the race, but this is where we actually fought him for a decent bit and got by him. Like I was running low on him. I'm down here. We ran low on him and got by him clean. I could have pulled up there. I didn't because I didn't want to get ran over. Plus I was running the bottom anyways. He gets a good crossover. I'm like, okay, he's to the bottom of us. I'm not going to cut him off. Run the high side. He almost wrecked the 77 there. Almost came up into the six as well. We're fully clear of him on this back stretch. And I go low and he just sends it in us, spins around, and that causes the huge stack up on like lap four. Everybody's wrecking. Everybody back here pretty much. It was just a massive pile up. And then off this restart, I think, was this where I got super high? Oh yeah, this is where I like ran too high in turn one or something. And uh, I think, was it? Or I just had a bad jump. Oh yeah, I just had a bad jump. I stayed a little high, but the one car like had a good jump and took it three wide immediately down the front stretch, which wasn't a good idea. I don't think the bottom guy knew that, obviously. We got bumped and then, yeah, this is where everybody got sent up. And then the one car actually went flipping. The one car went flipping and he came back and won this. He literally had to tow to the pits, didn't he? Oh no, he landed it. Wow. He landed that, but that was a, a big ass wreck too. Go back. Oh no, I think that's just him coming off the... uh pits isn't it yeah this was the restart yeah he went flipping the 77 went flipping because he gassed it up mid corner like he gassed it up right there got into the 77 got into me and then he got flipped over and so did the 77 the 77 had to tow it to the pits which is unfortunate he's trying to get out quick and that caused another caution yeah i think yeah, that caused another caution. See, that's what I was trying not to do. The 77 pulled out, caused a caution. Because he pulled out where everybody was still coming. 15 got ran over. And everybody starts piling into that. Oh my goodness. There was so much going on. Then the next restart, the 11 car had an awful start. And then got hit by the 6. Who is this? The 14... Just kind of ran straight into the corner and got on the brakes to try to turn. Oh my goodness. People got flipped. What happened here? What? Wh oh, this is where this is where I was talking about where I got too wide. Because I think he said sorry for this, but I got super sideways getting on throttle and got straightened out and then people got flipped back here because he let off for me and then the 98 just got up in him. So actually this part wasn't my fault because, uh, he was on two wheels getting on the gas. That was kind of crazy looking. Oh my goodness. This race was such a mess. Off of a restart. 15 and the 20 get collected together. 20's doing cartwheels. I think he ended up DNFing out. He was one of the three. One car got into the 404 there and then trying to straighten it out gets hit again. Another restart. 404 gets hit by the 88. The 88 got into a lot of people. I'm shocked the 88 didn't DNF out of this. Oh my goodness. The 18 went two wheeling into the fence up there. Boop. <laughs> and goes flipping. Lands it though. The six car was just too impatient. That's why he DNF'd out. He got into a wreck just from not really uh, checking up. These guys are just beating and banging trying to turn around. 11 car getting in the corner, 18 got into him and then completely runs him over. 
then just drives under them. Lovely. <laughs> oh, these these are ridiculous. I'm pretty sure we're green at this point, are we? What is he doing? Is he waiting for people to come around to cause a caution? Cause it's green flag. Nope, he comes out now. Okay, he should be fine. There should be no caution for him. I was wondering why he was sitting there. I thought he was trying to bring out a caution, but he did not. 20 in the 404. 404 slid up a little bit, but 20 like cut way down to way too early. There's people below him anyways. 88 ran over the 15. And that's what I saw behind me too at this point. I saw, cause I think behind me, or no, I don't think I saw that behind me. Never mind. I think I saw when the 404 was in like fourth place, he spun out. I don't even remember when that was at this point. What is going on here? What is going on? Everyone's trying to get in the pits at the same time and now they're trying to wreck each other in the pits. <laughs> oh my goodness, this race. These people are trying to wreck each other in the pits. And the 18 got into the 44. Six car DNFs out right there on lap 23. This is where the one car throws a slider up front and then we're all according up and the 18, 88 just gassed it up. Like you could literally see him gas it up. Like I'm just off the gas. I break a little bit, but the 88 literally gasses it because I'm trying not to run over the guy in front of me and then we go flipping. These things flip way too easy. I have that. I do have to say that. So that's unfortunate. 55 or 15 just got on the brakes on entry. And I think that was it for him. And that was all the incidents because there that was the last uh, one. But we somehow come back, get 10th or we got ninth out of it. OK, how do we get ninth? Who do we beat? I guess the three car. I don't know. I'm confused. I know we got around the 17 there at the end and we were behind the uh, 18, but we got ninth. I'll take it, I guess. Still probably going to lose my rating, but may not be as bad as it once was. So let's go see what we end up getting out of the results. All right, results in strength the field is pretty low 20 just under 20 2300. I cannot speak There's only 20 people that registered so everybody was in this race. We lost 35 So we're back below 4k again lost a bunch of safety get a 6x, but it is what it is How many wrecks were there 12 cautions? 12 cautions that is abysmal like that is just so terrible 10 car led pretty much every lap besides the last couple the one car got him there at the end even though the one car went flipping he still won the race which is absolutely crazy 10 car probably the only one yeah only one with a zero X besides uh, the 19 down here who did not race. And uh, he that was probably a smart decision for him because that was a terrible race overall. But that was just that was just awful. So probably the worst race I've been in in quite some time. This race had more flips than a damn circus did. So it was it was ridiculous. But uh, it was fun up front while we were there. But there was just way too many cautions. I feel like it could have been a good race if we didn't get all those cautions. We had like one or two here sprinkled in, the, in there. Would have been all right, but uh, just every other lap was a wreck besides once I got flipped and then we had to try to chase down the rest of the field and uh, probably could have gained a couple more spots if we had a caution quickly, but I'm just lucky to be on the lead lap and get a spot there at the end. So I'll take it, I guess, but absolutely ridiculous race. But if you guys are still here, I really appreciate you guys. You guys are the diehards and I couldn't do this without you. Or I wouldn't do this without you because that race was just that race was just dumb and I just wouldn't even have uh, stayed in it at that point once I got flipped. But wanted to finish it out to show you guys where I ended up getting and everything and just seeing what we could do at the end. And luckily we stayed on the lead lap. So appreciate you guys for watching as always. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.